Jayco Hummingbird 17 bunkhouse. I'm going to do a quick walk through on the outside and inside. It's Laura with Worldwide RV in Main Street, off Main Street in Mesa. And so we're going to take a look on the outside and inside of this RV. It's pretty awesome. So walk with me. So we got the awning out and the steps. You can see it's a nice lighter weight easy model single axle which makes it easier to pull and it's the Baja edition tire so let's actually go into this and take a look so it's a little bit higher up off the ground with your tires you got the outside speakers outlets cable connections um, right there manual jacks easy to put down a little bit of storage here for anything that you need Tinted windows. When you get the RV with us, you're part of the, you know, Priority RV Network. So you got a lot of locations across the nation. It's already equipped with the wire wires for camera. So it's a plug-and-play camera that you can easily put in. Great regular sized spare tire, bumper, nice kick plate here, a little light for the license plate. modern looking tail lights all right so here we are we got the 30 amp connection another connection for the cable um, and satellite black tank fresh water tank low point drain and an outside shower always the best to be able to rinse your hands off or even your dog or dirty feet <laughs> if you go to the beach or something sand off if you like camping at the beach I like this little slide here because it gives you just a little bit of space for walking walking around looks like it's got a good amount of windows as well oh I'm sorry so here that was the gray tank I'm sorry the black tank is here which is kind of uh, right under the bathroom shower combo that's inside and then there's another little drain right over there as well So this is pretty pretty nice. So If you don't know what this door is, it's because you you have the bunks and so it's another exit Storage underneath the bunk and then when we get inside you'll see the top bunk But it's another little exit. That's really helpful to have so here we are looking at the weight, the gross vehicle weight, all right. I'm getting myself confused, but should be should be pretty lightweight. There's the pounds and the, and the um, cargo carrying capacity. You don't need to put a lot in this. It's such a small unit. So it's basically gross vehicle weight is less than 4,000 pounds and then the cargo carrying capacity. And so you're, you're doing pretty good here. Holds one propane tank. This one has a power jack. Um, if you don't know what this is, it's to make it so nobody can hitch up and take it. It's a lock. So you definitely want to use that when you unhitch or when you have it at your house. So we're going to take a look inside now. Nice easy two step. Ooh, it's nice and cool in here because the air is running. There's that second top bunk right there. Easy to climb in with curtain privacy. Shelving for everybody that would be coming. <laughs> and even a furnace area. So here's the slide, nice and opened up so that you have all this floor space. And this is a this is a U-shaped like dinette, but it can be put down as a full bed. It's not all the way set up right now, but this makes it so that you can sit across from each other and eat, or you can take it and have a bed, or even two other beds. So you could actually, actually sleep four people separately if you don't want to sleep together <laughs> or together in this bed nice blackout 
kind of shades, not the blinds, but the nice decorative shades. Single sink, double stove. Let's take a look at the wet bath area. So you got shower, sink, and toilet all in one. And the fan and the vent. I don't know if you can hear that, but that's that nice air coming out. Inside speakers. I mean, this is a really, really great model. Even more space, closet space or shelving. Carbon monoxide detector. If you want to have a table stored or a table stored, it looks like you have this area. Fishing poles or whatever you need. Entertainment is here as well, so you can see where your gallons and water capacities are at. Open and close the slide, open and close the awning, turn lighting off and on. Got the speakers, and you can store, you know, some of your music right here. And then you have even the HDMI connection and the regular, you know, sound connections for a TV, but you got car charger so you could do a 12 volt um, TV oh actually it says the TV the 12 volt outlet is for the TV power only and then there's a regular outlet so I'm thinking it's pretty pretty great pretty great model and we have it here at Worldwide RV let's take a look one last time Jayco Hummingbird 17 BH so if you want to take a look at one of the hummingbirds, we have other models and floor plans, then you can come out and see me here at Worldwide RV. Ask for Laura or send me a message. I'll have the text message on the, on the descriptions below. Thanks so much.